The people who make me happy are my fans. BTS Jin opens up about receiving true happiness through ARMY in a recent interview. Jin BTS sat down for an interview with Vogue Japan and shared comments about the pressure of working without his fellow group members, future goals, his source of happiness, and more. On Thursday, October 24, 2024, Vogue Japan published an interview with Jin, who opened up about the most important thing in his life, which is happiness. Notably, his upcoming album is titled Happy, and he revealed that he finds true happiness through his fans, commonly called ARMY. The Moon Singer said, The most important thing in my life is happiness. The people who make me happy are my fans, ARMY, BT Test Fandom. If I can make ARMY happy, they will make me happy. I have to keep trying for them, laughs. Jin further opened up about his future goals that involve not only the members, but also the fans, he said. It is my dream to make ARMY members happy. So as long as they are happy, I can work until I'm exhausted. I'm currently in the process of realizing that dream. In the upcoming news, so it's PIOP. Fans jostle as Jin BTS reveals the flavor profile for his upcoming pre-release song. I'll be there. On October 24, 2024, Jin BTS revealed the song profile for his upcoming pre-release single, I'll Be There. The pre-release track is part of his long-awaited debut solo album, Happy. The idol divulged the flavor profile via Wevers after a fan shared a link to the pre-release song and asked, Si Chin, what kind of flavor is this? He replied, Soda flavor. Jin had mentioned the flavor of his album during his interview with Harper's Bazaar Korea for the magazine's September 2024 cover story. On August 14, Harper's Bazaar Korea published a cover story with Kim Si-chin, Aka Jin, where they explored different aspects of his life and profession. When Jin was asked about his next solo album and how it would sound, he gave an indirect hint about his upcoming work. Likening the songs on his happy album to different flavors of ice cream, BTS Jin said that the songs would vary from soda to candy and dark chocolate flavors. Hence, this indicates that Jin is ready to try new genres and bring something unique to his fans. He attributed his next song, I'll Be There, to the soda flavor, which is also a genre of music. The soda pop genre combines pop, rock, and electronic music. Therefore, Jin BTS reveal on Wevers sparked anticipation among his admirers on various social media platforms. Expressing this excitement, a fan on X wrote, So this is pop. I'm so ready for it. Many fans who didn't realize that the soda flavor was related to a music genre were surprised. Wait, so soda pop is a music genre? I keep learning new things every day since I became an ARMY. Yes to soda pop, wrote a fan on X. BTS is going to do all these genres that I don't know about, like their soda pop. A fan said, what I'm soda pop is actually a music genre? I think he's just teasing us, wrote another user on X. Some admirers thought that Jin was teasing them with this ice cream flavor. Next looked blushing. BTS's Jin imitates Bak Jong Won at Salon Drip 2. In Salon Drip 2, Korean boy group BTS member Jin would once again captivate viewers with his visual charm. The episode was hosted by Jang Doo Yin, and it showed Jin's cheerful and charismatic personality. Jin was seen wearing a stylish white t-shirt, ripped blue jeans, and a beach cardigan against a background of purple balloons. In the clip, Jang Doo Yeon opens the conversation and says, It's accomplished with a lot of your wishes. I heard you're very handsome around the world. Showing his confidence, Jin replied, Of course, there are those who are better looking than me, but that doesn't mean I'm ugly. This laugh-filled conversation perfectly illustrates the BTS leader's blend of humility and charm. As the conversation continues, Jin shows his comedic side by impersonating famous chefs Bak Jong-won, 
Lee Yan Bok, and Park Myung Soo, effortlessly mimicking their catchphrases. Jang Du Yian asked Jin about his generous act during his appearance on reality TV's Kien's Bizarre Bandy, where he gifted the staff with squid. I paid for it, but the squid cost like gold, he joked, showing off his wit. The full episode of Salon Drip 2 featuring Jin will air on November 5 at 6 p.m. KST, serving up more heartwarming and funny moments. This appearance comes alongside promotional activities for Jin's solo album, Happy, which will be released on November 15.